Well, I think there's a tremendous need for awareness and for education around angioedema. That's part of why I participate in these, um, these uh, outreach efforts, if you will, is to make people aware that this is, this is a, a real condition, first of all, which is obvious, but it, it really does impact people's lives. And there are fatalities, there are deaths from angioedema. I'm Dr. Mark Rydell, and I'm uh, an associate professor at the UCLA David Geffen School of Medicine. One of my clinical interests is angioedema, um, and that includes all forms, so um, we can talk a bit about the specific types, but I do see many patients with angioedema, which is the symptom of, of swelling, either of the skin or other parts of the body. Um, in addition to that, I'm interested specifically also in immunodeficiencies, and some angioedemas are due to an underlying immunodeficiency. Now, most of those, we would put them in the bucket of sort of allergic angioedema, but that simply means that it's caused by histamine release, by certain cells, mast cells being triggered. And the trick is most of the time we can't pinpoint why those cells are getting turned on, why they're getting triggered. As a specialist in angioedema, I, I see many patients, but I only see them for brief periods of time in the office usually. And I take a history and I hear what they're going through. I think this film uh, captures what it's like to go through the process of, of being evaluated, of um, some of the frustration of these idiopathic forms uh, where we don't really understand the cause, um, and maybe most importantly, the sort of day-to-day -day life of, of living with the symptoms, of trying to manage the symptoms of the tremendous trial and error approach that we have, which is the reality of medicine. We have to try some things and see if they help, and if not, move on to the next. So, so I think it's very unique in that sense. It's sort of a, a journey through living with this condition, and, and that's not a perspective that I had seen, uh, you know, certainly not in film. I think that anyone who's interested in angioedema or is uh, dealing with angioedema, that this, this film, Life Without a Fork, is something uh, worth taking a look at. And I think it will um, strike a chord with people who are having similar experiences in their life.